So practicalities, when you've had this new product in your clinic, yeah. it's already made up. So how, how has it improved your, you know, your, your, your efficiency, how you run your day or, or how you approach your consultations? So practicalities, when you've had this new product in your clinic, yeah. it's already made up. So how, how has it improved your, you know, your, your, your efficiency, how you run your day or, or how you approach your consultations? That's an interesting question. So initially we were approached by, by the company telling us that we're saving X uh, amount of time uh, and, and can either squeeze more in more patients and do other things. But very early on, I figured I would not shorten uh, my patients' visits because, as you know, our patients um, um, want to spend a certain time with the doctor. What I now do, instead of spending time focusing on the preparation of the product, I can spend these extra moments focusing on my patients, which they appreciate because every eye contact in the end matters during a visit, even if it's just five or 10 minutes. That's one thing. The second thing is, I mean, contamination has not been an issue, to be honest, with, with neuromodulators. But again, it, it decreases steps where you potentially could make a mistake. So that is something that I think uh, accounts for something. And last but not least, uh, it is very precise. I mean, you have this, the pre-diluted product contains exactly the same amount of active substance in every drop in every vial. Whereas, you know, if you dilute with saline, sometimes you get a little extra, sometimes you lose a drop. Again, I don't know how much it really mattered in the long run in the past 30 years, but it is, you know, just getting a bit closer to how it should be. And um, also we have different uh, I was responsible for a for, uh, large number of injectors and everybody, as you say, is, is doing a bit differently. So it helps standardizing the process. So precision and um, safety for me was certainly um, a, bit, a bit of a step forward there also. Thanks so much for watching the podcast clip. You can listen to the whole audio episode of the podcast on your favorite podcast app on Apple Podcasts or Spotify. And please also leave us a review on the podcast app. If you like what we do, please smash the like button, consider subscribing to the channel, and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you get notified when we release new content.